you, Chris. Ride-sharing companies such as Uber and Lyft have changed the way we get around. And a new study suggests they could be making San Diego safer. 10 News reporter Amanda Brandeis takes a closer look. Technology and innovation has made it easier than ever to leave our keys at home. Rideshare drivers believe they are making this city safer, but say we could be doing even better. When you open up your Lyft app. Let's back up safely and look both ways. Kelly Colvin might be the driver who takes the call. Well, I do enjoy uh, getting everybody out and about. They seem to want really go out and have a great time knowing they'll get home safe. He's been a personal driver for almost 40 years. There is no excuse. And is a strong advocate against drinking and driving. You wake up and you feel lucky that you made it home, but that's rolling the dice, you know, and, and not just with your life, but everyone else's, and that's unacceptable. Colvin knows firsthand the devastation DUIs bring. My mom spent seven years in a wheelchair because of a drunk driver, and I really took that to heart. So he's encouraged by a study that shows DUI arrests have gone down in several major U.S. cities since ride-sharing apps were created. Uber launched here in San Diego in 2012. Since then, DUI arrests fell by 32 percent. That solution is in everybody's hands. It's a cell phone. A San Diego police traffic officer credits fewer DUI arrests in recent years to education, enforcement and alternative transportation options. But there's still a lot of work to do. According to Mothers Against Drunk Driving, the number of DUI related deaths hasn't significantly dropped in recent years. I like to be uh, part of the solution, not part of the problem. Colvin says he'll continue to drive as long as he can and is hopeful we can one day beat this problem. Amanda Brandeis, 10 News.